This question is from Gate Mechanical Engineering of 2014. This is question number 47 of set 2. The question is Steam at a velocity of 10 meter per second enters the impulse turbine stage with symmetrical blading having blade angle 30 degree. The enthalpy drop in the stage is 100 kJ. The nozzle angle is 20 degree. The maximum blade efficiency in percentage is Let's see the velocity triangle for impulse turbine. So the velocity triangle for impulse turbine where V1 and V2, V1 and this V2 are the inlet and outlet absolute velocity. VR1 and VR2 are the relative velocity at inlet and outlet. Alpha1 is the nozzle angle and alpha2 is the absolute fluid angle at the outlet. U is the mean blade velocity. So let's write U mean blade velocity. Okay. In this problem, we need to find the maximum blade efficiency. Okay. So let's write the expression of blade efficiency. So blade efficiency is given by eta b, which is equal to two times of mean blade velocity divided by v1, the absolute velocity at the inlet, whole multiplied by cos of alpha 1 minus u by v1 and this multiplied by 1 plus k into c, okay, where k is the frictional coefficient, k is equal to vr2 by vr1. Okay. Now we, we need to maximize this blade efficiency. Here let's substitute u by v1 is equal to rho. So again we can write the expression of blade efficiency eta b is equal to 2 times of rho into cos alpha 1 minus rho multiplied by 1 plus kc. Now, if we need to maximize this eta b, the blade efficiency, we need to differentiate it with respect to rho, the ratio of uh, mean blade velocity and absolute fluid velocity at the inlet. Okay. And we must equate it to zero to get the value of rho for which eta b is maximum. All right. So let's differentiate this. And we must equate it to zero. So from here, we'll get the value of rho that is rho is equal to cos alpha 1 divided by 2. Now for this value of rho, eta b will be maximum. So let's say this be equation number 1 and this be equation number 2. If we substitute equation number 1 in equation number 2, we get eta b max. Okay, so maximum efficiency here we'll get is equal to two times of rho instead of rho we will write cos alpha 1 by 2 multiplied by cos alpha 1 minus cos alpha 1 by 2 into 1 plus k into c okay so this value so 2 will cancel out this will be cos square alpha 1 divided by 2 into 1 plus kc okay so this is the maximum blade efficiency all right now if the blade is equiangular okay that means c will be equal to 1 and we are also neglecting the friction so this value k will also be equal to 1 okay therefore we can write the expression of maximum blade efficiency eta b max will be equal to cos square alpha 1 by 2 into 2 so this will be equal to cos square alpha 1. Now in the problem, we are given the value of alpha 1 that is equal to 20 degree. So it's very easy to find the maximum blade efficiency. So the maximum blade efficiency eta b max will be equal to cos square 20 degree. And this value is equal to 0 0.883 or in percentage we can write 88.3 percent. Okay. Now let's go back and fill in the blank. So the maximum blade efficiency is 88.3%. For more information, you can refer to the NPTEL course, lecture number 23, Impulse Turbine 1, 
on steam power engineering by professor vinayak n kulkarni of the department of mechanical engineering at iit guwahati